Yes, leadership. What is the most le What is the most important <laughs> lesson you've learned in your life? And how would you apply it to your time? I've I'm learned my mistakes because all my mistakes are subject to be corrected. Olit <laughs> olit. What is the most important lessons you you've learned in your life and how would you apply it to your time as Miss Universe? Silent lang. Hello Philippines, hello world, hello international, hello globe, hello universe, and today, why am I hungry? This is our last stop, kasi. so I will, I just have to have the opportunity na i-challenge ang ating guest for today. Oo, medyo pareho kaming, uh, the feeling is mutual because pareho kaming beauty queen, so... Oh, nararamdaman ko ang nararamdaman niya. And she is so excited to our challenge for today. Easy lang naman to, Q&A lang. Oo. Oh, oh. And sisi na sisi 'yan sa kanya pansit kung baga. <coughs> ang Q&A. <coughs> so wait lang ha, mag-signature muna tayo. Ano ba? Signature. Para nanalo at signature. So ladies and gentlemen, Miss International Philippines 1983, third runner-up. Miss World 1984, fourth runner-up. I was in a position. And Miss Earth candidate. Bini bini Philippines. Candidate. 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 1985. Nagtry siya ulit ng Miss Universe Philippines 2021. Makeup artist, makeup artist, na lang siya. Surrender na siya. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Marichoy, aka Melmar Ladrera. Hi. 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 Are you excited for our Q&A for today? It's a challenge lang natin how spontaneous you are, how good you are at speaking and communication, di ba? Kasi you are a host, di ba? Yes, I'm, I am an event host po. Especially in the wedding, the view, and... Okay, okay, okay. So how old is Melmar na? Alright, I'm 38 years old na po. Okay, so... Are you ready? You want to think about it? Let's start the question. Go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ladrera. Ria. Ah, Balcorza. Let's go. Let's go. So question number one. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. What is a woman's greatest asset? A woman's great, great, greatest asset is um being. Ayo, nusa masagot yung woman. Ah, the fact of. Um, having a child. Dahil sila na po yung nakagagawa nun. Yung ano, sila talaga na... Giving birth. Giving birth. So Giving that is the... Giving birth. I'm sorry. Greatest uh, asset ng baba. Yes. Okay. Their asset na hindi magagawa ng iba. What is the one thing you love about your country? The one thing I love about my country is the smile of the Filipinos. Because the smile of the Filipinos symbolizes happiness and happiness symbolizes Positivities. That is why Filipinos can rise up even if they are facing the greatest um darkness in life. Sing it, sing it. Pangaling no. Thank you. Kala nyo ha. Okay. Hirapat para tayo ng mga tao. Ay sumakop. Sumakop. What famous person does your personality most parallel? Marian Divisor Santiago, the late Marian Divisor Santiago because she's a strong woman same as me, I'm a strong woman for all the challenges and trials in life like Marian Santiago she faced all the challenges in her life with the image of a strength woman a strong woman, like me 1, 2, 3 10, 10 <laughs> Which celebrity would you like to invite to a dinner party and why? I would like to invite Chris Aquino because 
um, being a squatter people. <laughs> Sorry, no. um, and in Film Settler, the term is, in Film Settler, I really wanted to experience the ambience of having an etiquette in table, just like with Aquino. <laughs> guys. Mahirap na yun na. If you could change one thing about the world, what would it be? I wanted to change the word bullying. Instead of having the word bullying, it just should be um, happy, you know, ha happiness. Because what the world needs now is the word happiness. Love. A love. Sweet love. Okay, okay, okay. What bothers you most about what is happening in your country today? Um, in time of pandemic, the the, the most um, uh, the most thing that bothers, bothers me a lot is uh, uh, the um, the critic of people about the government. We all know the government is the spur head of the country, and they really don't they really know how to handle such. Um, Pandemic times like this, so why does people critic government? Well, in fact, they are doing their best to settle everything. One, two, three. Nakangga talaga siyang dalawa. Ganon siya. Pa silang mga bata. Ah, okay. What is your favorite thing you have learned about in school? Actually, I am achiever. Honestly, I am achiever during my high school elementary times. Um, the lesson that I really uh, love the most is the word confidence. According to my teacher in grade 6 and in 4 year high school, you should be confident in all ways, um, in all means and in all time. Dahil you really don't know what will happen um, sa place, dun sa oras, or the moment. Dapat confident ka of all times. Para po, um, you are ready. The word is confident to be ready always. What is your favorite song? My favorite song is Heal the World. Because it's very, uh, very relevant. Timely, timely I'm relevant. relevant to the country right now. What is happening during, in, uh, oh. especially in the pandemic. Especially you know, we don't want you to come here. Oh, oh. <laughs> like this. <laughs> what is one word to describe your country? One word to describe my country is welcoming. You know that Filipinos are happy people and they are so welcoming, especially the strangers or the foreigners around the world. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> if you won the lottery, what would you do with, with your winnings? Um, I really wanted to be honest. Uh, I, I want to spend most of the money for myself, no, for myself and for the family. And the fact, kung meron pa bang ma, ano, kaning sobra, o oh, ibibigay ko po sa mga nangangina. As beauty queens. <laughs> what is the one, number one thing on your bucket list? The number one thing in my bucket list is um, to be successful. Sa akin, the number, one, the number one thing on my bucket list is Bakit niya po iniwanan? <laughs> <laughs> bakit list niya? Ang <laughs> oh, uh, usap ay bakit nga word? The B U actually bakit usap? Okay, ano ba? Kami na kung bakit nga why? What is the nicest thing someone has ever done for you? Um, the simple gesture makes me happy, like giving flowers, especially um during my 25th birthday, someone gave me ah uh, kung ano simple flower, oh. one stick of flower, and that is um. Uh, but I remember one of the memorable happiness my because life. it's the thought that oh the thought count. oh yes it's not it's not the quality oh. of of the things that was given or materials it's the thought uh, yes matters what has been the most memorable day of your life so far <laughs> I think every day is a memorable oh day. every day is memorable pero um in and to answer that question the the most memorable um happening in my life is when I was uh, in po ako ng magulang. We will not talk about it because <laughs> oh. diba, it's ano, a sad memory. How do you distress? Jack. Ah, sorry. This Jack. Huh? Jack. How to distress? Eating. Eating, uh, is, eating so, is the best game. Oh yes. Like or sleeping. Okay, I'm sleeping. Eating is happy. Where would be your play? 
where where would be your dream place to live? My dream uh, dream place to live is everywhere. Basta nandun po ang loved one ko. Kiro ko! Kurban ko! Sa mga day. What is your position on climate change? Ang bottom pa ako. Position on climate change? Actually, in helping, in battling the climate change, we should know our capacity. So, <laughs> the info drive, maybe the info drive through med social media, yon, magagawa natin yun to combat climate change. If you could start a club for kids at your school or in your community, what, what so, would so, so, it be? If, if, if you could start a club for kids at your school or, or in your community, what would huh? it be? LGBTQ, I really wanted to... For I kids? I, for, yung mga batang bading. Uh, I wanted to build a club for them. Para naman po, to boost out their confidence. A club? Of of what? <laughs> a group. A guidance from oh, guidance. Um, to boost out their confidence. Na, kung sino talaga sila. If you could write a book about your life, what what would its title be? Colorful, uh, no, the rainbow. We all know that our life is full of colors, and color symbolizes different aspects. We have um, bright colors for happiness and dark colors for sadness and for darkness. So, rainbow ang title. <laughs> <laughs> what is the best piece of advice you have ever received? Piece of advice that I have received is being humble. We should always be humble of what we have just achieved in life. Kung anong nangyayari sa buhay natin, be humble always. If you could have any superpower, what would you choose and why? I wanted to fly, to distress, at paiwanan po lahat ng problema ko dito sa lupang tinatapakan natin. Ako gusto ko storm kasi para maalis ko itong bagyo dito. Binabagyo na kasi kami. If you were an animal, what animal would you be? I wanted to be butterfly because I want to give colors. Um, colors is other term for happiness, and butterfly has a ano lang um, small range of lifetime. So, kahit pa um, ano maliit ang oras sa tinitig sa mundo, at least we um, gave them somehow ng mga remember para sa atin. So that is color. Colors are happy. If there was a movie made about your life, who would you want to play you? Hmm. Sino Maybe Bea Alonso. Huy! Si Brenda na lang. Hindi ko sa TV. Sino ba? Artista ko. Artista nga. I wanted... Actually, it doesn't matter the beauty, Mangot. It's uh, what matters most is how he the same. Uh, ano ba? The how same, he oh, the, carry know, the role, oh, the character. The, oh. So the best one is sino ba si si Mama Mia? Ay ano ba yun? Oh, Mia. Mia. I see. Iya. Iya Mina. Iya Mina. Mama si Mama. Si Mama ya Mama. Magaling si Mama. Si oh, oh, Hi Mama. Er. <laughs> Are you okay? 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 I'm so actually I am um, oh. welcoming to the strangers, so the foreigners. If an alien will land on our earth, <laughs> I, I, I offer him food. No, because I know a long travel at I know the the go to Philippines, so I will offer him a food. Okay. This is from Miss Universe 1973 from Margie Moran. If you had one million dollars, what would you do with it? I will buy a house and that for myself, and the rest will go to my family and relatives. And okay, last but not the least, 
What is the most important lesson you've learned in your life and how would you apply it to your time as Miss Jungle? <laughs> Miss Universe. I work a lot in the slum. Di talaga. Well, um, yung actually balik naman niya, di ba? Um, the learning um confidence in Oh yeah, the confidence, being confident always. And I will apply it to example if I write a title I will raise a voice no, for all those shame people to be confident always para they are ready always yeah, to handle the situation and every moment in life. Last na lang, gusto kong marinig kasi sa iyo to. If your name is not called as the winner, how will you respond? I will just smile because uh, being a winner is just doesn't matter about the title. If you are be a member or if you be a participant or a candidate in the such uh, in, in the in a competition that is the real winner. I'm just mine. Diba? Wala tayong masabi. So, <laughs> tapos na siya, wala. Mag, mag... Oh, oh, oh. Isip ako. <laughs> Latin, award Latin. <laughs> oh, marami yung awards high school. He has 24 medals. Yeah, uh, during my high school. Oh, during my high, during high, during high school, school. niya, And, isa siya sa naging uh, leader ng school namin dati, 4th year ata kami, 3rd year I was siya. awarded as Governor Bambi Imaino Leadership Award, National, ano ba yun si, si, ito, Makabayan, ano yun? Oh, sige sabihin. Kabayan, Noli de Castro Leadership Award. Ano sa pa? I have all, uh, the mayor was Redemptor Hardin Leadership Award. <laughs> <laughs> oh, kamo, kamo, isa-isa lang mo. Genius yes, Leadership Award. What is the most le- what is the most important lesson you've learned in your life and how would you apply it to your time? I've I'm- learned my mistakes because all my mistakes are subject to be corrected. Ulit ulit. Ayong ayong. Ikaw. What is the most important lesson you le- you've learned in your life and how would you apply it to your time as Miss Universe? Silent plan. What is the most important lessons you've learned in your life and how would you apply it to your time as Miss Universe? What is a rainbow? Uh, rainbow? Oh. Uh, violet. <laughs> rainbow is violet. <laughs> 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 so yeah, uh, thank you Melmar for sharing your very witty and knowledgeable brain, you, my god. <laughs> okay, yo, ano nga nga? Nga nga tayo, di ba? Ang galing-galing ni Melmar. So, oh, mag-plug ka ba naman? Huh? YouTube. I don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel in Daikatok and my Facebook page in Daikatok. Awesome. And also, uh, my YouTube channel is Bagyong Uyog and my Facebook page, Happy, Happy Uyog yeah. TV and my Facebook account of uh, Oyong Sabi. Ah! Jig. 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 Huh? Please, I subscribe my channel. I'm sorry. Uh, Jig Jag channel. Uy, gila ka! Lagi ka! Halika. So, thank you, thank you again. Thank you, Melmar. Thank for the you. Bye, bye, bye. See you on the next video.